Welcome to my channel. If you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe. Today's video is going to be a gel polish video, how I apply gel polish at home. I really like doing this because, as you know, if you are subscribed to my channel already, I am a hairdresser, so I'm always in the water, so I hate using normal nail polish because it chips very quickly and I really like to have my nails painted so I love using the gel polish at home it saves you a lot of money and um, it's just really fun to do your own nails so um, today's video I'm using the Madam Glam gel line I talked about this in a recent video I will I will leave it somewhere around here so you can go watch that I explained all about it today is going to be a demo on how I like to apply it um, I also have a coupon code for you guys if you guys are interested after you watch this video if you want to go purchase your own um, gel polish and stuff like that I have a 30% off coupon code and it will be valpack 30 I will have everything listed in the info box just so you guys can check that out all about the products and the coupon code and all that good stuff I really like this gel polish company they have so many different colors to choose from and it's just an amazing company so if you guys are interested on how I apply my gel polish at home step by step then make sure to give this video a thumbs up and just keep on watching okay so this is what the kit looks like it comes with the little LED lamp um, three polishes but it comes with the base the top and then your choice of color it comes with wrap foils to remove the polish a wood sticker and a um, nail file so this is the base coat right here that I'm showing you this is the color I will be using it's the color rose and then this is just the top coat so you have to be careful when you're doing these because the base and top coat look the same so just make sure to see what they are then you need some nail files and right now I'm just going to shape my nail the way that I want it I'm kind of going for a more square look so I'm just going to file my nails the way that I want them and just make sure they're even on both sides so once you're done filing just compare the two together just to make sure that they are even and <clears throat> Once you do that, you're going to go in with a nail buffer, and this is just going to really smooth your nails out and make sure that they are nice and smooth. You don't want any lumps or bumps on your nails when you're applying the gel because you will be able to see it through the gel. So with this nail buffer, it works miracles. It literally just makes your nails really, really smooth and prepares them for the gel. The nail buffer doesn't come with the kit, but you can find one anywhere. So this is what the nails should look like, and they are ready for polish. So I'm going in with the base gel coat. You want to be very careful when doing this because this step is very important. So you want to keep it very, very thin because it, for some reason I find if you do a thick coat of base gel, it just doesn't apply it nicely. So you want to make sure you're doing very thin sections but you also want to make sure you're covering the entire nail so that is why as you can see I'm kind of like maneuvering my brush back and forth because I'm really making sure that it's getting everywhere you want to make sure you get in the crease of your nail if you do not cover the crease of your nail when you apply the gel color it's going to shrink which is a pain and it usually happens all the time but you just have to be very careful so this part you're going to put your nails under the lamp and it only is set for 30 seconds but you have to cure each coat for 60 seconds so you're going to press the lamp twice for each layer that you do so i do my thumb separately uh, you can do one nail at a time and it will cure better but for the sake of this video and the time i just did my four fingers at once and then the thumb so i'm going in now with the gel color polish and this is in the shade rose it's such a pretty color I've already done um, two other colors by the same company and I love them so I figured I'd choose this color for the video so you just want to do a thin first coat of this you're gonna do two coats total but for the first coat you're just going to do a very thin coat and make sure that you get it off your cuticle and just take your time with this because this is going to really show in the end when you take your time so just do very thin coats I like to do like three strokes just to like cover the nail perfectly and like I said you want to make sure you get every corner of the nail 
So I'm going to put them under the lamp for 60 seconds again, but like I said, they're only 30 second intervals and then the lamp shuts off. So you just wanna make sure you turn the lamp back on after it shuts off. So this is what the first coat should look like. Now I'm going to be going back in with the second coat to make it more opaque. You can do however coats, however many coats you want. I suggest doing two and that should be enough. You don't want the gel to get too thick. But what's very important is on the second coat to make sure you coat the edge of your nail because that's what's going to lock the color in place. And then we're just going to let this cure again for 60 seconds. This is what they should look like once you have done two coats. So now I'm gonna be going in with my top coat. And as you can see, I'm rocking the brush back and forth just to remove excess product because you don't want it to be too thick. And I'm just going to coat my nails in this and make sure they're covering the entire nail. Once again, you don't wanna do too much of this because then it can get really cakey and that's when it's going to peel off. So now I'm going to cure this for another 60 seconds. I really recommend doing two nails at a time. And also I do, I usually finish one hand and then I'll go and do the second hand because it's easier that way, it doesn't make a mess. So once you have finished that, you're gonna go in with some rubbing alcohol and a cotton swab and you're just going to wipe the excess stickiness off of your nails. It's not going to take the polish off because they're already cured, but this step just removes any tackiness. So once I finished both hands, I went ahead and washed my hands and you want to just wipe off your nails and make sure they are nice and clean. And this is the finished result. Now you are left with some at home gel nails. I hope this video was helpful for you guys. Make sure to use the coupon VALPAC30 for 30% off. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.